Toyger Cat vs. Maine Coon Cat What are the differences between these two cat breeds? The name of the Toyger is a combination of the words toy and tiger. The mixed breed was originally developed back in the 1980s by Lady Sugden who decided to crossbreed a Bengal named Millwood Rumpled Spotskin with a domestic shorthair called Scrap Metal in a bid to bring awareness to the issue of tiger conservation. Along the way, a street cat from Kashmir was also involved in the process to help bring out the breed's distinctive tiger-like stripes. The Maine Coon, as the name implies, hails from Maine, where the breed was known as a popular mouser, farm cat, and ship's cat, as far back as the early 19th century. They're a natural breed and little is known of their origins. Some say the Vikings brought them to North America, centuries before Columbus sailed the ocean blue. The main color of the Toyger's coat is orange or tan with darker vertical stripes. These distinctive stripes can either be broken or they might branch off. The mixed breed is relatively low maintenance when it comes to grooming, with their denser coat only really needing to be brushed once a week. Although, as with all cats, keep a close eye out for any mats that might be starting to develop while you're grooming. Remember, regular brushing will help keep the cat's coat clean and healthy. When it comes to climate, the Toyger is a generally seen as an adaptable cat who can usually live happily in most climates, just remember to always make sure adequate shade and fresh water is provided when the temperature spikes. A Maine Coon is a big, rugged cat with a smooth, shaggy coat who looks as if they could put in a full day mousing on a farm in all weather conditions. Indeed, they were built for just such work in the harsh Maine climate, and their breed standard reflects their heritage, calling for a medium-sized to large cat with a well-proportioned body that is muscular and broad-chested. A Maine Coon has substantial, medium-length legs and large, round paws, well tufted with fur, to serve as snowshoes during winter. A heavy coat is shorter on the shoulders, longer on the stomach and breeches, long fur on the upper hind legs, with a rough in front and a long, furry tail waving a greeting. A medium width head is slightly longer than it is wide and has a squarish muzzle. Large, well tufted ears are wide at the base, tapering to a point, and large, expressive eyes are green, gold, greenish gold or copper. White or bi-colored Maine Coons may have blue or odd eyes. The brown tabby pattern is so common in this breed that many people don't know Maine Coons can come in any other colors or patterns. They might be surprised to learn that Maine Coons are found in solid colors that include black, red or white, all tabby colors and patterns, bicolors such as blue and white or red and white, and patterns such as tortoise shell and calico. Hello! This video is sponsored by Bmix Pets. Are you looking for high quality cat collars at an affordable cost? Check out bmixpets.com. Use coupon code KITTENLIFE to get 20% off. When it comes to personality, the Toyger is one of the most affectionate and loving cats around. While they have a striking big cat appearance, this is a mixed breed that will love to cuddle up with you for snuggles while you relax on the couch. Befitting such a social cat, the Toyger enjoys human company and having people around this is a cat who thrives in a busy household rather than one where they're left alone for long periods of time. The Toyger is also a super smart cat who can be trained relatively easily, and the breed is often renowned for taking to outdoor adventures on a safe leash and harness. In fact, in many cases pet owners have trained their Toyger to play games of fetch. Unlike many other cat breeds, the Toyger is also said to enjoy playing with water, just like big cat tigers in the wild. The good-natured and affable Maine Coon adapts well to many lifestyles and personalities. They like being with people and have the habit of following them around, but they aren't needy. They're happy to receive attention when you direct it their way, but if you're busy, they're satisfied to just supervise your doings. Close a door on them and they will wait patiently for you to realize the error of your ways and let them in. They're not typically a lap cat, but they do like to be near you. They also retain their skill as a mouser. No rodents will be safe in a home where a Maine Coon resides. Even if you don't have any mice for them to chase, they'll keep their skills sharp by chasing toys and grabbing them with their big paws. A Maine Coon also enjoys playing fetch and will retrieve small balls, toys, or wadded up pieces of paper. They can climb as well as any cat but usually prefer to stay on ground level. They're also very smart and will happily learn tricks or play with puzzle toys that challenge their brain. Maine Coons usually enjoy a kittenish love of play well into adulthood. Males, especially, are prone to silly behavior. Females are more dignified, but they aren't above a good game of chase. Not especially vocal, they make any requests in a soft chirp or trill. The Toyger is a smart, athletic, and intelligent cat so you'll need to ensure that the mixed breed is kept physically and mentally stimulated. A cat tree or access to furniture they can safely climb up is a must. It's also advisable to provide interactive smart toys that will keep the feline sharp and satisfied. 
If you consider bringing your Toyger outside, make sure that you use a safe leash and harness and supervise all outdoor sessions. Despite the length of the Maine Coon's coat, it has a silky texture that doesn't mat easily, if you groom it regularly. It is easily cared for with twice weekly combing to remove dead hair and distribute skin oils. Useful grooming tools include a stainless steel comb for removing tangles and what's called a grooming rake to pull out dead undercoat, which is what causes tangles when it's not removed. Use it gently, especially in the stomach area and on the tail. Maine Coons are patient, but they don't like having their hair pulled any more than you do. Check the tail for bits of poop stuck to the fur and clean it off with a baby wipe. Brush the teeth to prevent periodontal disease. Daily dental hygiene is best, but weekly brushing is better than nothing. Trim the nails every couple of weeks. Wipe the corners of the eyes with a soft, damp cloth to remove any discharge. Use a separate area of the cloth for each eye so you don't run the risk of spreading any infection. Check the ears weekly. If they look dirty, wipe them out with a cotton ball or soft damp cloth moistened with a 50 to 50 mixture of cider vinegar and warm water. Avoid using cotton swabs, which can damage the interior of the ear. It's a good idea to keep them as an indoor-only cat to protect them from diseases spread by other cats, attacks by dogs or coyotes, and the other dangers that face cats who go outdoors, such as being hit by a car. Cats who go outdoors also run the risk of being stolen by someone who would like to have such a beautiful cat without paying for it. The Toyger is a great match with kids. The cat will form strong bonds with the children in your household and become like a new play pal for them. Just be sure that early socialization takes place and boundaries are properly set on both sides and supervise early interactions between kids and cats. When it comes to other household pets, the Toyger is also usually fine around other domestic animals. Although you'll want to make sure you oversee early interactions when introducing the cat to your household. Ultimately, early socialization really pays off with this mixed breed. Make sure to reward your Toyger for good behavior and adhere to a proper training regimen when you bring them home to your family. The friendly, laid-back Maine Coon is a perfect choice for families with children and cat-friendly dogs. They love the attention they receive from children who treat them politely and with respect, and they don't mind playing dress-up or going for a ride in a baby buggy. They're happy to live with cat-friendly dogs, too, thanks to their amiable disposition. Introduce pets slowly and in controlled circumstances to ensure that they learn to get along together. If you enjoyed this video, kindly press the like button. Also don't forget to subscribe with notifications on, so that you don't miss out on videos like this. Thank you for watching.